Yone is the sensible, dutiful, and sober-minded brother of Yasuo, who spent his youth reigning in his wild younger sibling. When Yasuo is accused of murder, Yone is one of the people sent to bring him in, and Yasuo ends up killing him. Awakening in the spirit realm, Yone is attacked by an Azakana, a demon that feeds on negative emotions, and when he's able to fight it off with its own weapon, he awakens back in the material world with a mask of the Azakana's face unmovably attached to his. Through the mask, he can see these demons and resolves to hunt them to find answers about his fate. That whole bit about how his brother killed him and there's a huge unresolved emotional issue there, eh, no big deal, they speak two lines to each other and it's fixed, don't worry about it. As a sign, if Yasuo is based on a classic Ronin samurai, then Yone is a classic demon samurai, wielding a blood-red blade that thirsts for the souls of spirits, wrapped in bandages and wearing an ominous mask. It's all very Shadow the Hedgehog anime edgy, especially with the floating bandages, but the character storytelling is solid. His language is seek and blood-red and dark against pale skin visuals tell you the kind of broody angst master that he is, and invokes classic imagery of demons and the undead. The shirtlessness is a bit gratuitous, maybe, but it all works. Subscribe to this channel for more reactions and hot takes, or head on over to my main channel for longer in-depth videos.